The arguments over whether Jeffrey Epstein should get bond and get out of jail will play out here in the morning in federal court in Manhattan. Epstein calls the accusations old, but prosecutors say the wealthy Epstein could flee. The federal judge should understand, hopefully, that he is an incredible flight risk. West Palm Beach attorney Spencer Kubin is represented in one lawsuit settlements for three young women who say as teens, Jeffrey Epstein lured them to his Palm Beach estate for massages that led to sex acts. Similar accusations form the basis for the new federal charges of sex trafficking minors filed in New York. Last week, Epstein's attorneys called the allegations dated and questioned their legality, given the secret deal Epstein struck more than a decade ago with federal prosecutors in South Florida. Now Epstein's attorneys propose a bond backed with a mortgage on Epstein's $77 million Manhattan mansion, his private jet, even his brother's home in West Palm Beach. Epstein would wait for trial on an ankle monitor and ground his jet and disable his vehicles. Whether he turns over his jet or his money or puts an ankle bracelet on or not, he has resources throughout the globe. Prosecutors cited Epstein's wealth and their motion to keep him behind bars until trial. They also said Epstein has, quote, demonstrated a willingness to use intimidation and aggressive tactics. Attorney Kuvin recalled incidents involving his own clients. For example, Black Tahoes would show up outside of their home, follow their family members, follow their cars. Jeffrey Epstein's bond hearing is set for tomorrow morning. In New York City, Chuck Weber, CBS 12 News.